Hello and welcome back to another video on Unpack Technologies. In this video, I'll be unboxing the Casio FX 8200AU calculator. This specific calculator is approved for HSC exams in New South Wales and offers a great set of features that are very useful for students. So let's get straight into it. All right, so before we get into the unboxing experience, we'll take a quick look around the box and I'll give you a little bit of background information. So this calculator costs about 50 Australian dollars and it has some helpful features such as giving you exact values for things. So when you're working with things like square roots and fractions and all that, it can help simplify it for you rather than giving you a decimal approximation. It also has some other useful features such as vectors, complex numbers, statistics, and more. So we'll have a look around the box and then I'll get this unboxed. So on the front, you can see, obviously there's a big picture of the calculator here with Casio FX 8200AU on here. AU presumably standing for the Australian model. And it says here, approved by Australian exam authorities down the bottom. On the right hand side, it says Casio again with class whiz FX 8200AU. On the back, it gives you a little bit of information about what the calculator can do, and it compares it with the popular FX82 AU plus second generation of their calculator, which I have been using for a long time. Um, so it gives you a comparison of what you've got there, and then uh, also some helpful links. On the left-hand side of the box, it says, display expression, same as textbook, and easy menu functions. Uh, and you can see it uses AAA batteries. So, and then on the bottom, it's just got more information about the model, and then we've got the part where we can open it. So we'll get straight into that unboxing experience. So I'll get my unboxing knife in here and open it up. And we'll get it opened here and get it out. So make sure we can get everything out of the box here. That looks to be about it. So you can see we've got the calculator obviously itself here, but we've also got some other things such as a little quick user manual as well as a warranty statement. And then we'll have a look at the calculator itself. So it's in this little plastic bag. Should be able to just pull open here. And then open it up. And there we go. So got the little case on the back. Um, I'll just have to see how that actually comes off here. All right, so I've worked out how this comes off. You just pull it off the top here. Uh, I didn't want to break it at first, but then that just comes off there. Um, and then you can uh, presumably clip it onto the front when you're not using it like so. So that's how the case itself works. And now we'll have a look at the calculator's function. So we'll turn it on here. We've got a few options here. Um, so calculate, statistics, distribution, table, complex, and vector. So we'll just have a little look at some of the calculation options that we've got here. So let's say that we had some complex fractions here. Um, well, let's go plus. Uh, just to pull in some things that may not be the easiest to work with. Um, and then we'll see how it handles it. So if we click the execute button, which is the equals button here, you can see that that's actually simplified it really nicely and given it into its exact form rather than uh, doing the decimal approximation that something like the FX82 AU would do. Um, and then other than that, it's pretty much all the same um, calculator functions. Um, so you can go around it um, like so. You can see I can change it between that or a decimal approximation if I would like to. Um, and there's different ways about going about that. I can go home and then go into statistics mode and do my statistics. I can do distribution. I can do a table, which is very helpful if I can if I program in fx and g of x as well. 
I can do complex numbers, which is good for extension two students. And then I can also do vectors. So there's definitely a lot of stuff here and it can be really helpful to save you some time in some of those simplification steps and it is definitely approved for the HSC. Now it will take a little bit of getting used to after using the FX82 that I've used for so long, um, but there's definitely a lot going for this calculator and um, it is really helpful and a big time saver being able to have it just do those exact values uh, without having to do all that manually each time. So that's really helpful. So yeah, that's pretty much the unboxing experience of the Casio FX8200AU calculator. I think it offers a great value for money at $50 by able to be simplifying all those fractions and other things like that and providing them in exact value form uh, when you're in an exam, that can be a big time saver. And it is great uh, that this calculator is approved for HSC use. So uh, definitely let me know down in the comments below if you'd like to see a more in-depth review of this calculator and all its features, uh, maybe even a comparison to the FX82AU. Uh, because I'm more than happy to make that if you'd like to see that and once I've had a little bit more time using this calculator and understanding the features. I'll leave a link down below if you'd like to pick up one of these calculators for yourself. And with that, thanks for watching this video on Unpacked Technologies. Don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next video.